Hey folks, Sheila here from Design Files. I just wanted to pop on with a quick video to show you a great new update that will help you really clean up your product library. So if you've been with us for a little while now and you've been adding loads and loads of products into your product library and you're feeling like it's starting to get overrun with outdated or out of stock products or even just items that you just don't plan on using anymore for future projects, you can use our new bulk delete and bulk archive feature to really start cleaning up your product library so that you can focus on those great products that you want to use for future projects. So here's how it works. What you want to do is you're going to go into your products tab within your design files account and you can just start selecting items that you no longer want to keep within your product library. You can go ahead and you can select as many items as you like. You can even jump between pages here as well. So you're not going to lose any of your old selections just because you jumped from one page to the other. It's just going to keep tallying them up in this button up here. So I'm going to remove a number of products here and when I'm ready, what I can do is I'm going to click into this button and I'm going to select the option to delete all these products. Now, here's what might happen. If some of these items that you are trying to delete from your library are actually items that are active in client projects, the system's going to warn you of that. So it's going to list all the items that are actually active in client projects, and it's going to give you the option to archive these products instead of deleting them from your design files account. So you definitely want to hold on to these items if they are active in client projects. All you're going to do is click the checkbox here and you're going to archive these items. What that means is that anytime you are creating mood board designs uh, and searching for products within your library, these archived items are not going to show up in your search results. So you don't have to worry about pulling these old products in accidentally into a new uh, client project. So anything that's here will be archived and anything that was not actually added to a client project can be deleted. And all you're going to do is come down to the bottom and you're going to click the button that says delete and archive the 18 products. Go ahead and do that and the system will remove all these items from your product library. And from there, you will now have a clean product library that you're going to be able to browse anytime you are creating your new mood board designs. And it will only be full of the products that you want to use for your future projects. So definitely pop in, give that new feature a try. It should help you tremendously if you have been with us for a long time and you're just feeling like your product library could really use an update. Thanks so much for watching. And as always, let us know what you think.